Welcome to the channel. We're doing a hot sauce made out of cayenne pepper and jalapenos. This was asked by our viewers, which we have plenty of them. We have from our garden some beautiful cayenne peppers right there. There's some beautiful jalapenos, some red peppers and some Capri tomatoes, so we're gonna add it. This is a half cast iron. Just gonna kind of uh, make it look beautiful on each side, kind of a brown them. The reason we're doing this is makes the veggies release those flavors, which is amazing. And you keep lifting in, you know. No oil whatsoever. Life is good. Keep cooking. We're sterilizing the bottles. Whoa. And they're shooting from there. This looks almost like Bridgeport. Whoa! They basically exploded. So we're trying to take the seeds out of this thing. Now we're gonna add a pinch of salt, good pinch of salt, and white vinegar, maybe a tablespoon or so. If we need more. And then maybe a little bit of the same amount of water. H-O-2. H-2-O. Oh, H-2-O. You know, chemistry wasn't my thing. <clears throat> I think it's a crime. More vinegar and I'm gonna add sugar. It is potent. And now we're gonna finally cook the sauce. Because remember, pretty much all the ingredients are raw in here. I'll say maybe 15, 20 minutes. Yeah, we can add a little bit of more water. <laughs> I can smell it right now. We have the sauce. It's being cooked about 20 minutes or so. And we added sporadically a little bit of a vinegar, sugar, and salt. The perfume actually of this sauce is so good. So we're gonna put it on our bottles. This is the final product and it came out really good. Thank you for watching. If you like this one, please uh, let us know. Leave a like and subscribe and have a wonderful day. So, we're making um, <laughs> cayenne pepper. <laughs> Let's see. Wow. Where's my beer? Oh, it just touched my the tip of my tongue, and that thing is on fire, man. But nothing that a good anti-spumante will fix. A what? Anti-spumante. Oh, spumante. Whatever the heck it is.